Hi, my name is Aaron Son. I'm the chef at the Highliner at the Fisherman's Terminal in Seattle, Washington. And I was going to talk about the Kita salmon that we use. Um, I love this product. The price point is great. It's a nice, lean, fairly mild fish. So it takes to the flavors that I like to use with it really well. So I'm going to go through a uh, special that I'm running today with it. It's a uh, grilled, glazed Kita salmon with uh, with a uh, Thai chili sauce and a sweet mango. So, <clears throat> I like to get the grill nice and clean. Get all the excess, anything that's built up on there. Now, when you grill the salmon, you want to grill it at, uh, at angles to get the nice diamond marking. So I'm gonna let that grill. I've got the rice cakes going for it. And I'm going to serve it with uh, grilled vegetables. So we'll let that cook for a little bit. To get those nice diamond marks on your fish, you want it to be pointing at 10 and 2. So right now it's pointing 10 o'clock. I'm going to flip it to 2 o'clock. So that'll give you that nice diamond mark. OK, the salmon's ready to flip now. So there we got the perfect markings on it. I'm going to take a little bit of this Thai chili glaze. It's, uh, it's got a lot of cilantro, garlic, soy sauce, ginger. Very tasty, kind of sweet and spicy. So we'll glaze that. So. And we'll continue to let the rice cakes cook. I'm gonna time it so that when the fish is done, the grilled vegetables will be done as well. So a couple minutes I'll throw those grilled vegetables on. And then we'll check the fish for its doneness. So the fish is ready now. And you can tell that by, if you break it open a little bit, it's almost going to look like it's still raw. In the middle, it's going to be a, a brighter pink. But um, one thing, it'll still keep cooking a little bit when it comes off the grill. So you want to pull it when it still has a little bit of that pink in the middle. And uh, it's going to be perfectly cooked. And I got my grilled vegetables going here. Some grilled zucchini and red bell peppers. They're tossing a little bit of balsamic vinaigrette. So we've got our uh, mango chutney. Goes really good with the, the flavor of the Thai chili sauce. So we'll just put a, not too much on the plate. Like so. And our veggies are starting to char up a little bit, which is perfect to get those nice marks on them. And give them a couple rice cakes. beautiful piece of Kita salmon, which uh, was literally caught a couple miles from the front door of this restaurant. So I'm going to give it a little bit more glaze on top of the Thai chili glaze. Sesame seeds, a little bit of parsley and lemon zest. So this is our uh, Thai chili glazed kita salmon with basmati rice cakes, grilled seasonal vegetables, and a uh, on the bottom a um, mango chutney. It's a hit.